In the heart of Rose Valley, Delaware County, My dearest love. is the nearly 100-year-old Hedgerow Theater. We are a resident ensemble theater company, so we have people who actually live in a farmhouse uh, all together. So we still have the opportunity to perform, and mm -hmm. intimacy is still a very viable option for us where it isn't for most other people. Greater than both by the all hail hereafter. In this pandemic, the performances are moving online to help Hedgerow stay afloat. We're trying to do a monthly membership, so, you know, Netflix for theater. This production of Macbeth will also be available to schools virtually. Normally they have to come on field trips to see theater and stuff like that. So we're going, well, why don't we bring that to them? Less than two miles away is the Media Theater, another historic setting where the pandemic forced the company to get creative. We are now just focusing on our educational programs for children, and we have an adult acting class as well. We all have to wear masks these days, but imagine you're acting. How do you read the expression on another actor's face when you can't see their face? I'm going to be teaching a lot about the eyes and how the eyes are the window to the soul. Even if you are smiling, you can see st still see it by the eyes and like your eyebrows. Students who participated in Media Theater's summer camp described the experience as liberating. It was pretty fun that I got to get out of the house because of my annoying brother. Um, because he's always annoying me. <laughs> Thy letters have transported me beyond this ignorant Back present. at Hedgerow, I wondered about being beyond cooped up during COVID. Indian. Certainly you're taking advantage of living together, but that must get a little nuts. <sighs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> there are challenges, like, you know, if Thane takes too long in the shower, like, I can bang on the door and yell at him. But also it comes with, like, a great advantage because you kind of have this family. And in these tough times, the family unread. leans on each other. Reporting from Delaware County, I'm Rosemary Connors, NBC 10 News. Hmm, oh, those annoying brothers. <laughs> <laughs>